I knew God and I was familiar with God. But one thing, when I got to Sisters in Christ, I felt the presence of God when I got here in this environment. In the past, I was one of those people to say, oh, never say never. But I can tell you right now, I will never be back in prison again and I will never do drugs again. In 2019, when I was released from federal prison, initially I went to live with my son and that didn't work out for me. So I um, was on my way to a homeless shelter. A friend of mine, she was like, no, you need to call Sisters in Christ. So I had gone on the website, filled out the forms that I have on the website. But Miss Carolyn called me later that day and I was like, well, you know, I've been out of prison a few weeks. I don't have a job, I don't have any money, you know? And she was like, don't you worry about things like that. She's like, I want to help you. And so, that's how I came to Sisters in Christ. The mission at Sisters in Christ is to allow women to find out who they really are, who God created them to be, you know, and to have the courage and the strength to actually find out who that is. This isn't just a place for someone to come and live. This isn't just a place for someone to come and get off drugs. You know, it's not just about coming in here, you get a job and you get an apartment. No, do you know how to pay your bills? Do you know how to pay a light bill? Do you know how to save money? If you would like to go to school to be a nurse, we'll help you find the resources to go to school to be a nurse. The main focus is to help you become your authentic self. When you've walked the path that I've walked, and when you're doing, trying to do things the right way, it's always in the back of your head, oh, they're gonna, they're gonna see me this way or they're gonna see me that way. You know, and a lot of people say it doesn't bother them, but it does. You know, it, it does matter, but I didn't get that here. I was not judged. I was not, I was accepted unconditionally. They believed in me. They believed in me and that gave me confidence to know that I could be relied on, to know that I can grow. Back in April of this year, which is 2022, went for a checkup, had a mammogram done, and, and I was diagnosed with breast cancer. It didn't, didn't devastate me the way that I would have in the past that I thought that, that maybe it would have affected me then because of the way that I live my life now. You know, I went through six rounds of chemo and I chose to stay here and still because I just couldn't walk away. I, just, I, I couldn't. I've rewritten my, my narrative. I've gotten the courage and the gumption to dig deep within myself and to become who, who I know I could be and who God wants me to be. And Sisters in Christ has also changed my life in a way that I want to pay it forward. In our sisterhood creed, we have a word reciprocity. And that's what it's about. It's about giving back and showing gratitude and being grateful for where God has brought me to right now. I get so overjoyed sometimes at the person that I am today. You know, I'm a mother to my children. I'm a daughter to my parents. I'm a sister to my siblings. Sisters in Christ is a sisterhood that you may not have even known that you needed in your life that can provide that for you.